Okay, so we're watching the data evaporate off an SSD. Here's the details of the system. This is Windows 7 Professional, and we had to enable AHCI in the BIOS, which meant, by the way, that the Windows 7 previously installed would not boot up anymore until we went and changed the registry to enable AHCI. Then we had to uh, have a SATA hard disk drive, and we had to enable Trim in Windows 7. It was, in fact, already enabled by default, but we checked. So the trim means Windows 7 informs the SSD when a, a uh, file is deleted. So we're going to do two things. We've got a hard disk, an ordinary magnetic hard disk in this window, and we've got an SSD in this window. And we're going to take some files. Now the files I'm using here are just a bunch of files that just contain a lot of ones. You can open this thing in Notepad. It just has a lot of ones. All right, And it's a whole gigabyte of files like that. So we put a whole gigabyte of files like that on a magnetic hard drive. And it'll take a few seconds to copy it over. This is drive L. Yes. It's kind of slow, especially after you get used to SSDs. Okay, now the files are on there. Now I'm going to press Shift Delete. So it's going to delete them without going into the recycle bin. And then I'm going to count off time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now it doesn't really matter because it's never going to evaporate. Here's the files. The files are still on that drive. It's deleted, so Windows can't see them anymore, but as you can see, they're still in the clusters. I'm just using a plain hex editor, HXD, and here's that file full of ones. And if I do a view refresh, they're still there. It's been 20 or 30 seconds, and I can do view refresh until the end of time. Those files are not going anywhere, because it's a magnetic disk drive, and that's the point. Magnetic disk drives remember data even after it's deleted, and that's why computer forensics is so important to find the leftover evidence. But the problem is that if you do this with SSDs in a modern system, let's put that gigabyte on here and notice how much faster it is. This is why SSDs are cool. Now if you do Shift Delete, and I'm going to count the time. This is drive N. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 9, 10, they're gone. Files on an SSD last for only 10 or 12 seconds, and then they're gone, and they're really gone. If I do a search, that there's a whole gigabyte of this string on there, and if I do a search, it's going to take a little while, only 23 seconds, though that's maybe not too boring to wait for it. You're going to find they're all gone. So this is a revolutionary problem in computer forensics. If you don't have to run some kind of sneaky software to hide your data. Just delete your files, and they really are gone when they're on an SSD, if your system is all up to the most modern specs. And that's what I wanted to show you. Thank you.